happy Friday. Didn't really have much to gab about today, but I did come up with a little idea to throw at the endomorphs for today. Um, I decided to take the whole day off because I had to uh, deal with some career objectives and do a bunch of research and all that stuff. And I'm just totally um, just, you know, crammed today. So what I want to talk quickly about is um, for the last few days, endomorphs, I have been doing the full, the beginning of my day. So 10 to about four nothing but fruits and vegetables um not even dressings and i've been noticing the trend of my weight continues to decline throughout the day from when i weigh myself in the morning and this just reminds me of uh, how fast the weight poured off back when i was doing the raw vegan diet so i just stress to you raw foods getting your body in an alkaline state as an endomorph will get a lot of weight off of you. I'm not gonna say this is gonna be the best for building and retaining muscle because I don't think that it is, but if you're trying to get weight off, especially fat loss, if you grab the wool by the horns and just do the raw vegan lifestyle, you can get a lot of weight off. Now, I'm not saying this is what I'm doing indefinitely, but I'm just letting you know that consistently, I can wake up in the morning, I can go all day just getting 100% of my uh, nutrition for phytonutrients, fruits and vegetables. And when the day goes on and the weight's going down, that's just showing you the trend of what things are gonna be like if you maintain that level of uh, commitment to that type of eating style. So, you know, as I've said in the past, carbohydrate doesn't seem to matter in regards to fruit when it comes to me. Now, I can't speak for everyone else, but for me, I've been able to eat upwards of, you know, 2,500 plus calories worth of fruits and vegetables in one day, and my weight still continues to decline. And I've talked about this before. So if you're someone that's massively overweight and you are an endomorph, that may be the hot ticket for you, at least for that first, like, 30 days 60 days if you can maintain that you can trim a lot of weight off and then maybe start your workout plan after that so you're looking at like maybe like a walking regiment you know during that period of time maybe walk an hour every other day and just focus on you know disciplining yourself you know to eating raw fruits and vegetables and they don't even have to be raw. You can have, you know, some, uh, what do you call it, uh, like stir fries in there or whatnot where you stir fry the vegetables. You know, that, that would be good for you. But, you know, uh, I, I have to share that trend because it's something that really, you know, has always stood out in my mind of how fantastic it is that, you know, you can be this person that's having problems losing weight. But then once you tweak this and switch over to this style of eating, you know, smoothies, um, you know, chopped up fruit, you know, uh, you could take the spiralizer and, you know, uh, make some uh, zucchini noodles, throw some tomato sauce on that. I mean, just, you know, the, the endless possibilities and the weight just continues to pour off, you know, it's like turn on a faucet, to be honest with you. So I hope that helps and uh, happy Friday.